Pacific. And who better to round up the coolest things you can find out east than Pei Chen. She's got gorgeous local pottery. She's got lobster. She's got it all. Hey, Pei, you're looking lovely today. And this must have been really fun for you since you're from the East Coast. It was really fun. I was able to look at some of my favorites and also find new products to highlight. And normally, by now, I would have been home maybe two or three times in the year, but I have not been able to get back to Nova Scotia at all this year. So it's kind of nice to have these reminders of home. I agree. And I, I love the fact that you've got a very discerning eye. You're supporting a lot of local businesses because the East Coast was really hit hard. Uh, so what do you want to start with? Well, let's start off with some potato chips. So something super casual, tasty for everyone, but not just your regular potato chips. These are the Atlantic Lobster flavor by Ooh. Covered Bridge Chips. Now, these are based out of New Brunswick, in Heartland, New Brunswick. It's home of the largest covered bridge in the world. So they do old-fashioned kettle chips, and this is just a uniquely East Coast flavor. Another company that I found out in New Brunswick that I really love, they do such beautiful maple syrup. So this is Wabanaki maple syrup, also based out of New Brunswick. It is 100% indigenous female owned. They have four different flavors. So you have your traditional maple syrup, but they also do three uh, flavors that are barrel aged. So you're looking at bourbon, whiskey, oak barrel aged. They do this beautiful gift pack that I thought was a nice way to sample the different uh, barrel aged flavors. So I love that it's so uniquely um, Canadian and so uh, particular to the East Coast and just such a gorgeous product. Now, I love Prince Edward Island, and I know that you love it as well. Um, Village Pottery is a place that I have visited every time I'm on the island. Uh, they are the longest-running pottery shop in PEI. They were established in 1973, family-owned shop. What I also love about it is that they feature the pottery of other artists in the area. So it's a great stop to go and get very um, unique serving pieces. And I just love that they have a lot of bright color. So whenever I go, I always pick up a piece and it just reminds me like when I'm having coffee of my trip to the island. This here is a taste of Prince Edward Island. So when I was there last year, I did an oyster shucking experience with a company called Experience PEI. But now that tourism has kind of gone downhill because of COVID, uh, what they did is they started shipping the taste of PEI to anyone who wants it. So you can order this lobster pack and they'll send it to you. So they send you um, cooked steamed lobster, these beautiful shortbread cookies from a um, local company, the raspberry cordial, which is so synonymous with Anne of Green Gables. You get some cow's creamery product, some PEI potatoes. Uh, something else that I really love is um, sea salt, especially really beautiful sea salt. And there's a company called Newfoundland Salt Company they just do the most beautiful product. They also have a little like trio gift pack. I like the idea of being able to sample different products and different flavors. So whenever I see something that's packaged in a gift pack, I'm like, oh yes, that means I, I don't have to choose, I can have them all. So like juniper, smoke, uh, smoked juniper, um, there's also like a nice coffee salt, which is great with meats or even some of your sweets. And now I found some great things on Etsy as well. Uh, I love this print because it's of Rainbow Haven Beach in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. And this is a Grace Levy photography. She does really beautiful prints of some iconic um, East Coast landscape and buildings. You've got Citadel Hill, you've got the bridges. So this is just something nice to have framed and give you a little reminder of the East Coast. Now this is also from Etsy. This is Brindy Linens. They are one of a kind hand printed textiles. Um, the images are hand carved onto blocks of linoleum and then they're hand pressed onto the fabric. Now why I really love this as well is all products are sewn by EcoWise. They're downtown St. John's. It's a local company that provides employment opportunities to adults with mental illness by giving them a caring and supportive environment. So in so many ways you're supporting local by having one of these products and they have such a unique story behind them. I love products that are actually giving back or doing something really good while you're also getting a good product. So thank you, Pay. Great roundup.